fucking tourists! He he ended up he ended up killing him. I got a big booty. Hold on. Let's but go. I don't care. What up? I'm all done. Let's go. Nah. I got Tourette's. Oh me. Cover me. I do, I'm a big guy. Can't help it. Well done, let's go. All right, Ladies go. love it. <laughs> Bro, you let you funny as hell, dude. Gee, uh, bro, I promise on my life. I'm also six motherfucking two. 200 pounds. Just imagine I'm a big guy. I'm bigger than... I'm, all right, the UFC fighters that, that fight at 200 pounds aren't ever 6'2". They're like 6'4". They're like monsters. I'm fucking stubbly. I'm, oh, right there. One down. That's one. I just helped this guy on my team. I got heavy hands. I got, I got weight to put into it. Dude, oh my god, I got calluses on calluses on calluses on calluses on calluses on calluses. Do I have what? Dude, how did my shit not shoot off? Wow, it said I tried marking him. I tried pressing R2 and shooting him. Bro, I work out, I fucking do pull-ups all the time, I, I work at a super fucking hands-on job, you little dickhead, I ain't got no fucking soft hands. I did not exist, I Shut the fuck up, I didn't No, I didn't. Wait, you can zoom? <laughs> Swag. Alright, I'll be right back. Hurry up. Swag, uh, we're supposed to be on the same team, bud. I didn't even hear his gun go off. Good to go. Yeah, after this match, after this match, I gotta make a, a quick trip. No, I just gotta make a quick trip. And I'll be back. What'd you say? Oh, fuck yeah. You don't want to play none of this? Nah, we can, we can play something different. I'm down as hell. Yeah, we'll play with OT. Yeah, I feel ya.
Boom. Bomb set. Watch your ass. Beautiful. We survived the group. Gotta finish off the rest of them. Yeah, I know you did. I won. I won. Me, you faggot. Uh, I came to fucking punch him and it didn't even let me throw a punch. That's fine, whatever. Game broken as fuck. Right. I'm with his dad. <laughs> Trip you out, boy. Damn, I guess not anymore. I'm fucking, uh, I'll be back. Yeah, yeah, I ain't, deal I ain't dealing with that match. I'll be back.
Yeah, what happened? Yeah, I'm back from Canada. Yup, boy. Nah, you know what I was gonna do? I was about to, uh, drop off Tiffany's TV at her house because she said she needed to get her TV back. But, uh, I told her to give... I, shush! Shush! I told her to give me back my phone, and she said she wasn't going to. I said, well, then fuck you on your TV. <laughs> so, actually, her TV her TV is like $300, $400 cheaper than the phone, actually, to be honest with you. But, uh, what I'm going to do next time is I'm going to... I'm going to go get Hunter, I'm going to walk up in there and take that phone, and she called the cops. I'm going to straight up tell the cops, be like, you know, sir, you know, I have proof that I've been paying this bill for the last six months. She hasn't paid a cent to it. That's my property. You know, it's mine. And that's what's going to happen. I don't give a fuck. I'm literally going to walk in, get Hunter, and grab that shit. It's going to be sneaky as hell. Nah, hell no. Nah, it's gonna be when I drop Hunter off. It's not even gonna be when I drop, pick him up. When I drop him off, it just makes more sense. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When I drop him off, I can just walk him in the house, play it all casual, be like, I'm gonna drop him off, walk around with him a little bit. Walk around a little bit. Yeah, no, yeah, right, right. I'm trying to do it, so I, I grab it, and then she realizes it after I'm home. Or after I leave. Because she's going to try to pull the, oh, you don't, what happens if there's an emergency and I can't contact somebody for our son? That's what she's going to try to say. But she's going to be sitting there talking to all the dudes that she knows. While I'm paying for it. Ain't that fucked up? Nah, no, nothing. Nothing was said yet. That's what's gonna be said. I'm just, I'm just saying, fuck her right now. Fuck that noise. Fuck that. Dude, everything. Nah, I'm gonna take that watch right off her wrist. Yeah, hell yeah, I did. I bought her the 38, not the 42 though. I got the 42 because I got a man wrist. She got a pussy wrist. Bitch. I want to kill her, honestly. <laughs> I don't want to take her clothes. I don't want to see her nasty-ass body. She don't even have a nasty body. I just don't want to see it anymore, ever again. I want some other dumbass loser to see it. I already did. I did a couple weeks ago. I didn't tell none of y'all. It doesn't matter. Uh, nah, nah. Trust me. Trust me. That was enough. Trust me. Trust me. That was more than enough. Nah, hey, hey, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you, it was fine, it was fine, it was good, but uh, I could tell that she's still been sleeping with somebody, and now I know she has been, so, it's, it's, it's good. That was my, that was like my number one, hey, that was my number one closure. What do you mean, how could I tell? That's not a, that's not the feel of a, that's not the feel of a, of a girl, hold on, hold on, that's not the feel of a girl fucking fingering herself or fucking rubbing her clit, promise you, that, trust me, trust me, I know the feel of girls like that. It wasn't wide, it was just, it just wasn't fucking, it wasn't tight, it wasn't shriveled up like it should be after not having sex for a while. That helped me. No, it helped me, honestly, it honestly helped me, it helped me, that was, that was my closure. She never gave that to me, so I played her ass, I got it, and then I was like, fuck you. Yeah, fuck yeah, she deserved that shit. She was like, for like days, she was like, all I can do is think about you, this and that, this and that. And I was like, yeah, well then fucking be with me. And she was like, oh, I can't, you're a liar, blah, this. And she fucking, she probably used my ass too, so whatever. You're a liar. Yo, for sure. Hey. 
Do it. Okay. Okay. I'll be right back. Oh my god, my mom is crazy. She a cunt, she a cunt, she a cunt, she a cunt, she a cunt. Oh yeah, okay, you come and live with my mother for fucking 29 years, and you take care of them as much as you take, as I've taken care of them, and you tell me that you don't ever want to fucking say that fucking shit. Alright, alright buddy. Your mom is still taking care of you. I'm taking care of them. I've been taking care of them for the last five fucking years. They took me away from my real life. I had a real place. I had a real life. And I came back because my dad was dying. So go suck a dick. 
I moved to a couple towns over, and I live with my buddies, and then I moved to Indiana. I moved a, state, a couple states over and live myself. And when I was living with myself, I was making bank-ass money, bro. I was making, okay, my place was 1200 a month. You know what I was making? I was making over 4 no, no, it's not, yeah, 1200 a month, 1200 I was making over $4,000 a month. I was paying that shit so easy. Oh, oh my God, I was so good. Dog, I could have. Dog, I could have lived there. I could have lived there for 20 years, and I could have been fucking. I could have had a uh, $500,000. I would have been fine. I could have made so much money. And then you tell me to. You tell me to be nicer to my mom. Guess what? I did. I moved back from Indiana so I could help her take care of him. Uncle. That's you, buddy.